This is a very strange car. It has no steering wheel. That's the only screen here. There's no dashboard. Uh, there's no seats even proper. There's just plastic panels with some uh, headrest. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's carbon fiber, seat belts, and uh, plastic. That's all there is. So this is a very lightweight uh, sports car. It's called the KTM Crossbow. This uh, rod here is of course designed to grip the steering wheel. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the interior. Now this is the steering wheel that's removable. It has a lot of buttons. Uh, the indicator buttons at the top, the horn button there, the uh, timer button, headlights con uh, controls, driving modes, and so on. And at the back, you have, of course, the pedal shifts. Those are designed uh, for you to change gears. If you pull the right one, you can increase the gear. Pull the left one to decrease the gear. Since, of course, it has no doors, that's why the steering wheel is removable, so you can get in and out very easily. If you want to adjust your seat, you can't do that, but you can adjust the pedals to move them away or move them closer to you. So that's a nice touch, at least. Well, why is this car so bare? Well, number one is to save weight, but uh, the car I am in right now, this is actually a racing version, so that's why it doesn't really have proper seats and it has racing seat belts. There is a road going version available as well that of course will have proper bucket seats and uh, you know proper headrest. You can even order this car with a windshield and uh, movable windows since there are no doors the windows will open for you to get into the car. So this is a very strange car it's actually made by a company that never made a car that's why it's so crazy it's made by KTM which is an Austrian motorbike company. The engine is in the back. It's a two liter turbocharged straight four engine from Audi. And uh, the initial model made 240 horsepower. Over the years, the power has increased to 300 horsepower. So having a car which is so bare minimum and so light, of course, that's a lot of, of power for the, such a car. So this car is on display um, at a motor show. I just came around to see it and I'm so glad I got a chance to sit in it. I visit uh, you know showrooms and uh, these type of motor shows as much as I can. So I have videos from all over the world. Now that uh, when I was getting in the car, they told me not to put my foot on the side panel here because that's part of the racing package. So the road going model isn't very dif different. It just has a visible windscreen and windows. Of course, those are also optional. But the great thing about this car is you can pretty much adjust the the suspension and the handling of this car as per your liking since this is the race uh, model so you can you know adjust the car's handling as per the racetrack that you're going to drive on now uh that's a very strange looking car uh, the aerodynamics are absolutely amazing would you have one i mean this is a very strange question because there, it's a very bare to the bone car there's no storage space there's no place to keep your phone in but of course if you want to have a performance based sports car this is one of the best cars that you can buy ktm is also making some other models as well and the next model is going to have a permanent roof and i'm hopeful for that as well uh, i'm sure i'll see that soon and i'll sh share a video of it as soon as i can so have a look at my channel i have videos of supercars sports cars modified cars luxury cars suvs trucks all types of cars even concept cars so have a look at my channel i'm sure you're going to enjoy it and thank you so much for watching this video